Yo, what is up? Roger Federer just loses to Sergio Stokowski in the um, Wimbledon 2013 second round. I'm going to tell you something. Um, from what I know, they made the grass sl more slippery, and um, they made it like uh, faster as well in this tournament. So that's why a lot of upsets have been happening uh, very recently. So, I mean, that's, that's, a, that's a pretty important thing to remember. So, I mean... You know, it's 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 interesting that that can happen, and also like Stokowski was serving and volleying a lot during the match, so I mean, it makes sense that he was able to kind of win and uh, you know utilize this new strategy to beat Roger and Federer. Kind of was caught off guard. Stok Stokowski's volleys are actually quite good, and his, he was serving very well. So I mean, I would never have predicted this honestly because Federer, Federer's kind of at the end of his career. You know, I think that this Wimbledon or the U.S. Open is like the U.S. Open is the last chance now that he has in order that he'll ever win a Grand Slam. I don't think he has the, the 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 drive or the motivation or the fitness really to compete against these top guys anymore. I mean, he, he's had a great career. I mean, because if he doesn't win this U.S. Open, I think that's the last one he's got in him. To be honest with you, I mean, he's been losing. He has he's only won two Grand Slams in the last like three four years. So I mean, whatever. You know, it's 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 upsetting. But I mean, Nadal even Nadal was shocking. I mean, people thought. Nadal losing in the first round was like um pretty shocking result, but I thought it was actually not not too bad because you know I mean the grass is faster. Nadal cannot is not a grass court player, and people were somehow shocked like wow Nadal lost 